Since its founding in December 2010, the Relationship Center has been a place of healing, growth, and celebration of relationships with self, God, and others. This has been accomplished through both an environment that is intimate in its warmth and peacefulness, and through the teaching, counseling, healing, and gatherings of celebration. We have a great opportunity to double our size by expanding into the basement beneath our existing space. Our heart has always been a threefold balance of body, soul, and spirit, which we will better accomplish with the expansion project. I am Mike Siri. And I'm Diane Siri. And we are the co-founders of the Relationship Center here in Wakanda, Illinois. About six years ago, we opened the doors to this place. It was the culmination of a vision that both Diane and I got to create a space where people could come mm -hmm. and be safe and could get healing and could get counsel and could celebrate. The Relationship Center is so appropriately named because everything Mike and Diane do, everything that I have a heart to do, it's all ends up revolving around relationships. So we all have different approaches, we have different techniques, we have different training, we have different licensing. Um, and I love that about this place. It, it opens the doors for all different kinds of, of work, but we all have the same goal. And once I walked through the door and actually had started having conversations with Mike, I mean, it was like I was home. By working with Mike and Diane, there's a, a, an incredible amount of opportunity that they're going to push you and they're going to teach you to bring you to a new emotional intelligence and a new spiritual freedom. We've just been blessed um, to be in this community, to work together, to be in this place, in the presence of God, and just do the work that, that God has blessed us and called us to do. I've had a huge personal healing and inner healing growth from Vicki Glow. So that's really my heart and my passion is to work with people to help them get to a place where they can thrive. I think one of the most exciting areas for us is the creation of the Epic Marriage Workshop. In my opinion, is one of the best marriage workshops I've ever done. And we've done quite a few, we've read plenty of books, but this one actually focuses more on you as an individual first and what you bring to the table rather than how do you fix your partner. Mike and Diane approached us about creating a, a companion piece to their epic marriage workshop. The piece is called I Choose You, and it's about you know choosing your, your partner through it all, um, continually ch making that choice to be in that relationship. For anybody that wants to grow in their marriage wherever they're at, if they're willing to put in the work and listen to the content that's being presented, take that, work with it, and sort of come back with what you have, you will grow. I was very much like almost overwhelmed with the power of it. We get to be a part of the lives of this community and what people are experiencing. We're up here counseling during the week, whatever, sometimes we have to limit the ability of people to use the space uh, for celebrations or for meetings or whatever, and to have um, a whole nother level where we can hold those kind of um, events, where we can expand the space, for example, to do our Epic Marriage Workshop. Our hope is to raise $30,000 to create a small group room and a multi-purpose space that will function as a teaching center, an artistic space, a fitness studio, and an intimate venue for life celebration events. We've been um, praying about this and looking forward to taking possession of the basement for about a year now. I think having the extra space downstairs as a bonus to bring people into this building is huge. I mean, it's another magnet to get just people through the door. Because I think once people get through the door, I think people will realize the benefit of this place and the people in it. In a space like the basement where you're gonna have no windows and you can completely have privacy. It's safe. It's a very safe environment. You can come in and know you're not going to be judged. And just be seen and be heard and be able to be vulnerable to, to be themselves. I know we would love to be able to share our story with other couples that have gone through a loss. They will take you in um, and they will show you the love that family should. <laughs> and we really want others to know what that feels like, to be able to feel like they had a part in the building of this new project and the existing building that they can come and feel like they're coming home also. So I'm excited. I think the space is gonna open up 
a lot of opportunities, some that we're aware of, some that we have vision of, and I think some that we don't even know what God's gonna do. To welcome more people, um, to have more opportunity for people to use this place. We need more help for that. Uh, we, we need more prayer, we need more money, we need more people that wanna come in and use their gifts here. Please make yourself known, please come be a part of this. We look forward to meeting you, we look forward to receiving whatever gifts you can give us. Bless you in all that you do, thank you.